the candle flame fairy tale. As soon as the giantesses had disappeared from sight, Linnea ran up to the court and ordered the swans to wake up the prince. When he had opened his eyes, he and Linnea embraced, then quarreled a little, and then made up again. Then Linnea told him that next time he should pretend to promise that he would marry one of the giantesses, but only if they told him what they did when they were not at in the cave, and what the secret written on the coat meant. At that moment they heard the giantesses coming back, and Linnea slipped behind an icicle again. As before, the giantess asked him roughly if he had not changed his mind. I shall take one of you for my wife, answered the little prince, but you must tell me where you go when you are not at home. And what is written on the coat? The giantesses were pleased, and they relieved that they went to a nearby wood to play with the golden egg. If anyone were to smash the egg, we should turn in a couple of black crows, they told him. Then they read him the inscription on the coat. It said, Magic coat, without delay, carry me off wherever I say. Then they put the prince back to sleep and hurried off to the wood to play with their golden egg.